Welcome back guys. I um, just did a video on doing this necklace but I wanted to add a chain to it because I'm just not happy with it and my other video was pretty lengthy so I'm just going to now do my chain piece. So I'm moving my ends, all my pieces I have here, I'm just going to remove them off. I can find my tin to take that one off and I'm going to remove my jump rings off this end This is why I do not have nails. I just try to do things with my fingernails. So I'm just going to remove that off. And I'm going to remove that one. So I've got some wire here. And what I'm going to do is Draw a couple of beads. I'll add some, just add different beads on here. Oh, I've got them along the track. So I'm just going to make once again I'm using my round nose pliers, my flat nose and my pointy nose pliers and I have chain. So what I'm going to do is make a little, um, I don't know what you call them, little piece to go on the end here. Focus point I think you call them. So I need my round nose pliers. And I need to add a, my necklace in there. And then I'm going to wrap just twice around. And then I'm using my flat cutters to the flush against my wire so I end up with no sharp points. So I'm going to flatten that down. So I'm going to bring this piece here back up to there. I'm going to cut it off. And I'll just keep all my little bits of wire because I can use them for, um, which is not too small, but lengths like this. I'll use them to make um, pins. And then I want my chain, so I'm going to cut my chain, well I did have my chain, I did have my chain somewhere, oh yes, here it is, I just need to Okay, I'm just going to cut it in half because I can um, move my I'm just going to cut it I 
I can adjust the length late when I what I'm happy with after. So I'm just going to bend this sideways like I showed in the previous video. Straighten out my wire so it looks like that. So oops that's not my round oh you said my round nose. So I'm going to bring that back towards me to make my loop. But I'm going to add my chain in. I've got my chain in there. So now I'm just going to wire wrap that around, try not to catch my chain. And I need my pointy nose pliers, pull it around. Squash it in so I'm not going to catch any skin. Okay. So there I've got my focal point sort of thing at the end of my chain. So I'll do the same to the other end. And I'll use the same bead. So I'm going to use a little glass bead. Oops, the glass beads are going everywhere. And I'll add another little glass bead. I'll be vacuuming up beads by the looks. Okay. So once again, I'm going to wire up this. So I'm going to bring it around to get my shape. Then I'm going to add my into my necklace. There. So and now I'm pulling it tight and I'm going to wrap it around. my the base of my loop. I only did it twice and I'm going to cut that off flush. Pinch it in so it doesn't catch anyone. So I'm just going to bring my wire down my beads down. I'm going to twist it over once again. Round those pliers, bend it over, cut it off, length off, and then I'm going to add my other end of my chain. So 
second I'm going to wrap around my wire. Okay, then I'm going to cut that off. I'll check for my ends. With no sharp points. It can catch on to your skin because there'd be nothing worse or catch on your clothing. Okay, so I'll move all that out of the road now. And then I'll cut my cut my chain a little bit shorter. So that looks a lot nicer. So I'm not sure how long I want it to be. I might go about there, I think. Just gives that little bit of length to it, so I'll just chop them off their level. At least I hope they're level. We shall see. Yes, very good. I think that one can be another two. Take them off about there, I think. Yeah. Then I'll remove the end here. And I'll keep this wire because the chain, I'm sorry, the chain I can use for other bits of jewellery. So I'm just going to add this on my chain. Close up my They're pretty strong these. And this is the chain is from Tamu also. Um, they're quite strong. So I'm just sort of moving it flush against the jump ring. So they're nice and flush. So then I will remove the other one. So I remove this one. So now that one to the other piece of my chain. Close it back up. Oops, that didn't close very good, did it? And there's the length of my chain. Simple as that. And then there's the earrings to match. I have got the other earrings somewhere. Here it is. There's my other earring. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Once again, go down and press um, subscribe, press the like button, leave a comment.
Um, this is only a carry on from my video that I was doing just before. So I'll put the other one as part one and this one's point, part two. Thank you for watching. Um, sorry for the um, little bit confusing there, but we got there. God bless. Stay safe. Bye.